The great classics of film noir had all these convoluted plots and all this fatalism, but they also had these remarkable visuals. Here's a great image from I Walk Alone. Burt Lancaster and Elizabeth Scott are standing tensely by a newsstand as a vendor is hawking a newspaper with Lancaster's image identified as that of a killer wanted by the police. This photograph from Cry of the City shows Richard Connie anxiously watching for the cops while Hope Emerson's opening up a subway locker where he stored valuable jewels. This is a photograph from Boomerang by Ilya Kazan. It's what's called a semi-documentary film noir because it was based on a real story. It had a lot of non-professionals and small roles and it was based on real events. This is a very, very characteristic photo from this film and it's in an unusual format of 10 by 13, so it's oversized. Out of the Past is one of the most legendary of all film noir with Robert Mitchum in a doomed romance with the ultimate femme fatale, Jane Greer. Check out the moody lighting, almost in silhouette of the two. 